We're here in Santa Cruz, California, Cutting Edge Homes. We're taking a look at the modular home foundation just before we set the homes on it. Important part of modular construction, we build it in the factory, and then there's concrete on site that's poured in as a foundation, and we gotta tie those together. So we're gonna take a quick look at the structural attachments. This is all, uh, uh, almost all Simpson hardware. So to start off with, you have your mud sill. This is what touches the modular home all the way around. It's connected with MASA straps. Uh, there are some anchor bolts on here, but we primarily try to use MASA straps because they lay flat over the mud sill and allow us to set the modular home right down on top of it. Secondarily, as you can see right here, there are some uh, anchor bolts and these heavy plates. We put those on the inside of the plate to make sure that the outside where a modular home rim joist sits down uh, is able to sit outside of that and sit down really clean. Uh, in California, where we are, we're, we're just south of San Francisco, there is a lot of seismic activity here. So we have to do a number of structural attachments that may not be common in other parts of the country. However, we never want to do threaded connections where our modular has to sit down in a precise place and tie onto the wall and where you're basically tying steel through a threaded con connection. It has to be absolutely perfect. So, what we use is strapping. First of all, this is an STHD 14 strap. It uh, goes up on the wall. They basically need to go up about 14 inches and then this will get cut off. That'll nail on. After it's on, they'll actually bring the siding down over on top of it. In addition, based on the new seismic codes in California as of 2010, we have to do some, uh, some other strapping. So these are uh, ST2215. You see a number of these just on this one plane. If you look over here at this foundation, I'm counting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 of them. Anyways, uh, the last connection is there's a steel rebar connection here. Uh, I actually don't know what it is. I'll have to look at the engineering, but it's probably something even more serious. So anyways, uh, that gives you a good sense of how our modulars are going to get tied to the foundation.